An unprecedented and unpredictable college basketball season begins on Wednesday as the Cats welcome in Moorhead State. And now for more on the Eagles, here's a season preview of Opposition Research. Up first for the Cats, Moorhead State. The Eagles begin the campaign seeking offense as their 13-19 finish fueled head coach Preston Spradlin and staff to supplement a roster that struggled mightily on that end a year ago. The inefficiency was a huge cog in their fourth consecutive losing season and one of their top storylines to follow in 20 and 21. Four key players return, but none average double figures. And while a couple of newcomers show promise, the unknown has Moorhead pegged for an eighth place OVC finish. The Pikeville native is familiar in these circles. A former grad and operations assistant with the Cats, Spradlin enters year seven at Moorhead, his third full season in the lead chair. The Alice Lloyd alum's reign began on an interim basis in late 2016, and his securing of the fort earned him all league coaching honors and the gig full time. Tyson Claude is the most accomplished Eagle and highlights the returnees offering up nine and six in his maiden voyage. The 6'8 sophomore connected on 60% of field goals and was the group's leading rebounder with 19 starts and three double doubles. Fellow classmate Talon Cooper did most of his damage off the bench as the 6'4 guard ponied up seven points and three boards while connecting on a respectable 39% from three. He was Moorhead's best foul shooter at 81% and should be a full-timer in his second season with the program. Brandon Berg's James Baker Jr. is the lone senior and author of 53 starts. He's one of MSU's top all-time shot blockers and a career seven-point-a-night score, but sank threes at just 19% last year. Davon Cooper set out all but five games with an injury and should factor in if fully healthy. He was a full-time starter two seasons back registering nine points inside of 30 minutes. Marcus Garrett and Janai Broom are worth keeping an eye on. The former Torch JC opponents for 1,000 points in his career and brings potential firepower to the backcourt, while the lengthy Broom is a rim protector and could flourish over time. The 6'10 freshman from Tampa was one of that area's top players in high school. Fast facts. The Eagles boast five Kentuckians on their roster. MSU's last NCAA appearance, a memorable one from 2011. Who's the play? Goodman at the free throw line. Jumper. <laughs> and the Cats lead the overall series in this matchup, 10 zip. It's the first of three at home, the Cats and Eagles, and it tips on Wednesday at 6 o'clock. For more on this matchup, tune in to the Leach Report tomorrow morning at 9. For today's opposition research, I'm Chris Labar, and have a great Thanksgiving.